Hello well guys, welcome back. Here we are at Minecraft. I know it's been a very long time. I am sorry for it being such a long time. Uh, I just, yeah, I guess I just haven't been feeling, feeling right. I didn't really feel like doing it. But anyway, now into the next one. So the last time we, we finished with making a little, little miner, a little stone bound miner, which is not very good. That's the wrong thing. Uh, is it that one? Yes, yeah, this one. As you can tell, it has very low durability, very low mining speed, not very high mining level. Um, it's just basic pickaxe, so it's nothing anything special. So uh, to make a better one, obviously people like using iron and whatnot. Oh, you need to build a smeltery, which I don't really feel. Uh, I did not think of this. But <laughs> did not plan this very well. Okay, hang. On. Um, so we need to make something called grout, which makes we need to make something called grout, which is this. Make it out of Clay, sand, and gravel, doesn't matter where you put them, you just put them in there. And we will just wait for this. I need another piece. Blah! Don't mind, don't mind anything else. Oh, I did have all the stuff to make ground. Oh, I thought I did. So now we have something called seared bricks. Now I've already got a bunch of them here, so we'll just take these. Uh, and what you need to do is then make something called uh, seared, seared bricks. So you turn seared bricks into seared bricks. That screwed up very badly. Um, there we go. That was weird. So you get a new book called Mighty Smelting, which is all about using the smeltery. Which we will do. So we've got instruction, casting, construction, alloys, and all that. So to make a basic one, we need all these different ones, which it'll, it tells us how to make them. That's the formation. Uh, that's all these different alloys, which I'll show you how to make. Uh, grout. Yeah, it's, it's a bit weird how it tells you to make grout in here, other than the previous book. We need to make a smeltery control, which I just use all the bricks. Um, let me just yeah. so we need a smeltery control, which is where we put all the ores into, so we'll actually do it. Okay, one smeltery control. We also need uh, a drain. Which is good. We also need. Uh, I think it's like. No, sorry, it's smaller control, so put a piece of that in there, so that's that. We also need a faucet, which we can, which uh, pretty much you come back like and it drains out all the different materials into it. And then we need uh, the actual thing we need to put all the casts on, which is casting table. So now that we can go up and make this, I haven't forgotten anything. So we need, I'll get rid of the two previous books, actually, no, I need the other previous book. We need the bricks, so then we need we need to start by a three by three area like that. Ooh, there, uh, you need a smelty drain. You can configure that however you want. I'm just configuring it the way I normally do it, but I normally have more than one drain. So do that. There. So it has to be empty on the inside. Let me just And you'll notice when it's ready when when that uh, lights up. So of course with the got rid of body Um I imagine it's going a lot better, I don't think planned out for once, or I thought it did anyway. No. So now we have a nice casting table which we can put our stuff onto. So this we don't need this. We we really don't need this. This is this is a little piece of crap. Uh you can make it very good, which is why I'm going to put it back in the chest. So we need some buckets of lava, actually. I forgot about those. About four should do. I need one bucket, I know that. So it runs on that, so we put lava and then it will... It says that, but it's actually got a lot more. The annoying part. So I have that. It's a weird loading uh, bug. But anyway, with that you can smelt down your different ores and stuff. So obviously you can smelt down the bars, or if you can get iron ore, you can actually double it. So if we put one in, and don't mind me, I'm just going to quickly get some wink for us. And then you know, drain? Yes, it's a drain. 
don't worry about that, it actually doesn't doesn't care that much when that happens. It'll, it's a very weird thing, it doesn't actually care that much if something goes wrong. So this, um, if you have enough to make a block of a uh, certain thing, you can make obsidian, if you, if you have two obsidian in there, um, you can pull it out and it will need two obsidian ingots to make it an obsidian, or a block of it. Got enough work it takes so long. Oh. Okay, um, I'll just, I'll need to get some more stuff anyway. So we'll wait, while we wait, oh, damn it. While we wait for that, I'll need to get some aluminium. That. Actually, I'm just going to get the main ingots, I don't really need the ores. Except it doesn't show up. Okay. So you need one aluminium and three copper. And that will make uh, uh, aluminum brass or aluminium brass, depending on how you want to say it. So this is where the parts you build for the these come in handy. You need uh, stone parts of these. Let's get some of this. Put that in there. So we need tool binding, tool rod, and we also need a head. And I'll show you exactly why. So there you go, so we have no, we have no two molten iron. So we pour into here. Break, we don't need it. Because uh, we're going to be making something else. We're making a, lot, a much better material. So we need some of those. And then you see, there you go, we have all our, we have all our fuel now. So really, it's, it's a kind of annoying. It's actually really awkward doing a tutorial on this because it just takes so long. Okay, so we have our we have our different uh, pieces. So what what you do with this is uh, the main factor is what you do is you need the aluminum brass which makes casts. Casts is what you pour metals into so it'll take that shape. Uh, molten metal. So that's what we do. We're gonna be making some casts. So we can pour our molten. Um, alloy into it, because there's an alloy I'm going to make, which uh, I'm only going to do one, because uh, it tells you how to make all the others, but I'm going to make the best one, which is called uh, Manulian, which you need two coal bowls, two coal bowls, and one edgerite to make, if you get, if you get two of each, then it'll... Oh, sorry about this, it does this, it's, it, it says it's mixer, but it hasn't. Which is the most, which is the annoying part. It says it hasn't mixed them, but it already has. So I'm so sorry for this. This does it. It's a really weird glitch. It does. It did it on when I was playing uh, Big Beast Monster as well. It does it. It's really annoying. I'm glad I have my cast in that. It just doesn't actually do anything. Maybe one thing. This is really. <laughs> um. Sorry guys, I had to go away for a quick minute. But anyway, I'm back and I'm going to hopefully finish this whenever I can. There we go. Um, I need to pull out all the bloody shit and put and just yeah, I really don't like doing this, but it happens. So anyway, so I'm just going to get the casts. Unfortunately, I can't actually um, make them. But all you pretty much do, when you have the molten aluminium, uh, aluminium brass, you pretty much just pour put put the piece onto here. Um, Put it on there, right click, pulls it out, makes a cast of it. Yeah, all everything's going wrong. This is horrible. <sighs> but I'm only, I'm only halfway done and I don't feel like doing it again, so we are going to continue doing this. So now we need the other one bit. And we need our tool rod. So, so we need manulian. Manulian, the uh, which I have got the edge right and the cobalt here. They are nether ores, they can, you have to go into the nether to find them, and they are not like iron, they do take some binding. Now I'll put some in there, I'll put some in here. So it makes something, it makes um, this, manulian ingots. And I'll just smelt these together. Hopefully they won't do the same thing with the uh, uh, molten uh, aluminum. But last time I checked, they do work. So, and then I can show you, and then I think, I'm going to have, 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 have a part 3, the next part will be the modifiers, uh, stuff as you can see here, the silky jewel, the lava crystal, ball of moss, 
all these different uh, modifiers you can put on them to put on your tools to make them better. I'll show you some uh, better tools as well. I won't be making them, I'll just show them to you because in the book, um, Materials and You, it, it shows you all the tools. You can see all the different tools in that. It shows you what you need to make to make them. You need to make them and stuff, so I won't, won't need to actually show you exactly how to make them. But Manulian is probably one of is the best material you can get. It has a very high durability. You have six cobalt, and I have six manulian, which is very good. So uh, we need a tool rod. So obviously, we, when you have a cast, you can if you right-click or force up the cast on the casting table, it will pour it into it, and there we now have a manulian tool rod. And then obviously, you do the exact same for that. I say that both takes half, so we have five left. And then a pickaxe head. I'll we'll take one. So if you do find some, at least make, um, if you if you manage to find one cobalt and one edrite, that's enough to make a full manulian uh, pickaxe. So I need to put these somewhere. Um, where's the chest? Wrong one tab. And there it is. No it isn't, that's the trap one. That's the one. That's what I always do. So when, when we build here now, obviously we have a lot better tool. We can go into here, put your pieces in. Bigger chipper. As you can see, we have 3,000 durability, a 9 mining speed, a mining level this is above obsidian, and 3 modifiers still. We have a big chipper. And obviously, I will show you exactly how well it does, how well it performs later, but that'll be in the next one. So for kind of these kind of shortest videos, it's just, yeah, it's just, I don't have that good internet, and it kind of doesn't like it when it's too much, uh, too large amount of videos. Now. But that's pretty nice, and I will show you the next part with all the modifiers and all that. And it's raining. Anyway, so yes, I will show you the next one, all the modifiers, uh, bigger tools, and exactly what. Because as you can see, this table only has small tools. I'll show you the better table. I'll show you how to craft it and whatnot. Um, I will also, also show you steel. Steel is very good material, but it's unfortunately there's not really a way to craft it. Um, I bet I'll show you this all next time. And well, thanks for watching. Uh, leave a like. Uh, you don't have to favor if you, if you really like it, you can favor it. And well, subscribe please. Everyone helps. I appreciate all of them. All my subscribers. I only have. I will say very little. So each one helps. Bye. See you guys in the next video.